conditions were so completely different to ours. Even though like it's still in Europe and pretty close to our country, you'd see a house like three stories high, lovely, like pillars and all that, and then right next to it would be a house with a caved in roof with ten people living there. <laughs> We set up our leadership program over six years ago to um, inspire young people to become leaders and to uh, use their leadership skills to serve others. Uh, and in that first program we, we came across Steve uh, Cooper and the work of Cry in the Dark and it seemed a natural fit for our young people. And so in that first year, five years ago, we sent a group of our young people over to Romania to serve uh, with Cry in the Dark and they came back and they were transformed. Um, I remember one of the young men said to me in the final assembly, uh, so whatever you do in the future, don't let it, that experience drop. That was the best thing I ever did at school. So it was obviously a very powerful experience for them. One girl, um, we found it really surprising um, how she could speak like almost perfect English. Mm -hmm. um, we taught her how to spell England and that was really nice because um, she tried to, um, she, we wrote Romania 2017 on the floor and um, she wrote England or tried to so we then helped her spell it and she wrote it again. It was really life changing so I definitely recommend it because it made you realise like how lucky you are to be there and like it sometimes just makes you realise and makes you think about life and other people. I found it really exciting to go as a member of staff because uh, it was great to get to see these guys um, realise lots of things for the first time and uh, they were really good at getting stuck in uh, to the experience of being there and working with people who were from a different culture and uh, who also um, had varying uh, needs um, but they got really stuck in and it was really enlightening uh, to get to see their perspective of enjoying it and really getting a lot out of it. <laughs> They just loved holding your hands and going round in circles. Some of them like wanted to go into the circle like the hokey cokey, but some were just stood stationary the whole time. So you'd be there holding someone's hand going in, and then like holding the other person's hand, like trying not to pull their arm out the socket <laughs> or something. <laughs> really describe it. It was just amazing. It's one of those things where you can say, oh it was really good, it was really good. Yeah, but you, can't but you don't really it. you don't have the words you to don't describe know it. how good it is until you actually yeah. go and experience it. Like people yeah. will be like, oh yeah they're just saying that but genuinely it is yeah, life changing. Yeah.